friends welcome back to another sister summer episode today is monday i got back late last night from my trip this weekend to visit my friends so if you guys didn't watch the vlog from this weekend get ready with me with a couple of my girlfriends i will have it linked up here go and check it out i really like that vlog and it was a really good weekend i'm happy to be home though even though i'm only gonna be home for today and tomorrow and then on wednesday i'm going somewhere else <laughs> i'm back with my buddy i was so happy to see him i miss him like crazy even when we're just separated for you know a couple days i think he did some camping or he went to the lake i'll insert a photo of my mom and squirtle um in my mom's hammock because it is so freaking cute i slept in a lot today um my voice sounds a little bit weird i need to like hydrate and get my day started but today is going to be running some errands and things like that i'm kind of slow moving today i feel like i need to go grab a coffee and i need to get, pick up a couple of things like do a couple errands and take some things to the post office that's what this afternoon is going to be we'll probably be just like running around in the car for a little bit um but welcome back to the vlog i got a package in the mail from tart and i'm gonna unbox it Satisfy your sweet tooth with Tarte's new vanilla fragrance. Oh, she cute. A warm, dreamy base of sustainably sourced Madagascar vanilla layered with essential orange oil. Tarte always packages up everything so freaking cute. Let's open this up. This is such a cute name for it. It's called Sweet Tarte. And then I got, I think, some cake pops. Let's see, what does it say? Van yeah, vanilla cake pops with little hearts on them. My camera like, does not want to focus lately, but <laughs> thank you, Tart. This is freaking adorable. I just finished packing up some Depop orders. And I took a shower. My hair got all like crazy frizzy though. Tomorrow I'm dyeing my hair back blonde, which is exciting. Um, I've been wanting to, and I think I told you guys that I was going to. I've been planning on it for a while, but I wanted to wait until June. And so that'll be tomorrow. And then, so in the next vlog, you guys will like see me with my new hair. But obviously you guys, Probably already know what I look like blonde because I've been blonde before for a while. I'm gonna go do some errands, drop some stuff at the post office, probably grab a coffee, pick up a couple other things, and just like drive around for a little bit. So let's do it. So it's raining. It's not even raining that hard. Actually, I should probably turn my wipers off. I'm listening to a little bit of Selena. I actually don't really know the song. I think I've heard it one time, but I kind of like it. Um, but I'm gonna head to the post office first. Actually, I think I'm gonna head to the Starbucks drive-thru first and then the post office because <laughs> I need caffeination right now. So I will see you guys. I hit up the promised land, the Starbucks drive-thru and I remembered my cup again and the guy was like really happy about my cup. He was like, it looks so good in that cup that you brought. Like shout out to my mom for this. From Starbucks, I love the vanilla sweet cream cold brew. I would say that's my favorite because it comes like vanilla-y and a little bit sweet, but not, I feel like it's the perfect amount of sweetness for what I like. So that's what I usually get. It's raining. I'm about to go to the post office now. And Squirtle's in the back. He is definitely taking a fat nap back there. And I feel bad because I forgot his leash. I was in a rush and I was carrying so much stuff out of my house that I forgot Squirtle's leash. Is this Selena again? I was listening to some Halsey and then, oh, this is not Selena. Gabrielle Applin. Who knows? I don't know. You know when Spotify does that like radio thing or like you play a certain artist and then once you play all the songs it like switches to another artist? I'm just talking nonsense. I'll see you guys after, <laughs> after my journey at the post office. All right, guys, it's getting sunny again. The rain's clearing away. Just went to Kroger. I went to the post office, did all my, sending out all my stuff, and then I went to Kroger. I went to the Coinstar machine. My total was like $10, and then I checked out from Kroger, and I got three things, and I ended up spending less than $10, so. Basically, I got paid $2.25 to go to Kroger, but this is gonna be actually the most boring haul of ever, but I'll still do it because why not? I got some almond milk because I have some cinnamon toast crunch that I haven't been able to eat yet. I got a shaving cream, pure silk, 
Raspberry Mist. Honestly, I really like this brand for shaving cream. It's probably one of my favorites, but I can only find it at like Kroger or Ralph's or something like that. And I got a new toothbrush because I think I left mine at my friend Isabel's this weekend. And obviously your girl needs a toothbrush. It's pretty boring. Um, I think I'm done with all my errands. That's pretty much about it. I wanted to go and get some bagels, but then I realized I'm going out of town on Wednesday and it doesn't really make sense to go and get a bunch of bagels. So I think we're gonna go home, have a little snack, probably chill for a little bit. Um, I kind of want to just like watch some Netflix. And I didn't have as many errands to do as I thought I did. I only went to like three places, but let's go back home. I don't even know how my camera is balancing right now. It's on like the top of a water cup and on top of my like mini little tripod <laughs> just so it'd be tall enough to stand on my desk and I could not have my head cut off but um it's been a few hours since I last vlogged and I basically just watched an episode of the Chelsea show which I pretty much religiously keep up with and I love that show I love Chelsea Handler she's like one of my absolute favorite celebrities and I really admire her and think she's really cool. If you don't watch her show on Netflix, um, honestly some promo, you should definitely go check it out. It's just called Chelsea. Super educational and interesting and funny and I love it. But since then, you can kind of see in the background that I started packing up a suitcase again. I unpacked from this weekend and then I started packing up a suitcase again because on Wednesday I'm going um, one of the dogs is like really angry outside <laughs> on Wednesday I am going to see my boyfriend who I haven't talked about he hasn't been on the vlogs um, we're long distance his name is Sean and I'm so excited for you guys to meet him we haven't seen each other in a month so the last time I saw him he was here with me and um, we went to a festival together and he met my brother, my mom, my dad. He's met everyone except Megan so far and Squirtle. So I definitely wanted to let you guys know that because I haven't talked about it yet. Um, mostly because like I said, he just doesn't live here and he hasn't been in vlogs or anything yet but i'm so freaking excited so my next vlog will be me traveling there he lives in boise um which is in idaho so pretty far away it was definitely closer when i lived in la but pretty far away from here but um i'm gonna go visit him on wednesday and i'm gonna be there for a week so that'll be like I think it'll be like four vlogs that I do there. I just ask you guys, I know you guys are like the nicest and most understanding people, but I just ask you guys to be like kind and nice and supportive in the comments because I get a little bit like, like a little bit anxious, a little bit just worried about like sharing my relationship the people that are like super close to me especially because you know like he's never been in a vlog before he's so if you guys just feel like nice and understanding and everything like that in the comments he's gonna be working a lot when i'm there but but we're still gonna have a lot of time together and i'm super excited because this month without seeing each other has felt so freaking long if any of you guys are in a long distance relationship like you know the struggle <laughs> um but it's definitely worth it's definitely worth it and it's definitely worth the wait. I'll show you guys what I've packed so far. Why not? This is the bag that I'm bringing. It's like a carry-on. So this is kind of like underwear and bras, a little floppy hat, a backpack, some pajamas, rain jacket, sunglasses, and then these are like kind of some outfits that I've started a little bit. So I have like four or five outfits planned out. Um, so I need like probably like seven or eight outfits and then this is some stuff that I'm gonna bring in my backpack on the plane and that's about it. Today's been a pretty chill day. I mean other than like doing a couple errands I really haven't done that much but the day kind of went by pretty fast. I think it's like 10 o'clock or something now so it's, it's a little bit late. Probably gonna just go ahead and start on editing this vlog. And I'm glad that I'm starting my packing tonight because I don't leave until Wednesday and normally I would never do this but I'm so excited. <laughs> and i just wanted to start tonight i will see you guys a little bit later all right guys it's actually the next day now i ended up editing for a little bit last night and then i passed out uh watching netflix in my bed so that was my monday I'm about to be on my way to go to my hair appointment so my hair is super faded out because I've been letting it fade over the past like two or three weeks. I hope I can go as blonde as I want today. <laughs> if you guys are enjoying Sister Summer so far, give this vlog a thumbs up. Go check out Megan's vlog from yesterday. See you guys in tomorrow's vlog, bright and early. Okay, bye guys.
girl in public, baby girl in private.